Welcome back throughout Black History Month. We've been highlighting local leaders and their impact on the communities they serve. And this week I got the chance to speak with Dr. Randall Gary, the superintendent of Spartanburg School District 5, about the importance of his role in making a positive change not only in his educators, but also in his students. Dr. Randall Gary came to Spartanburg District 5 in 2019. It's the best job I've ever had. A job which comes with a lot of responsibilities. Whether I, 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 I'm looking for it or not, I am a role model. As an African-American superintendent, Dr. Gary is among a minority. A 2020 survey by the School Superintendents Association showed only 8.6% of superintendents who responded identified as a superintendent of color. Of that small number, 42% were women. It's a reminder of how far we still have to go. A message Dr. Gary hit on as we celebrate Black History Month. I've seen some of the struggles. Um, some have been close and personal. Um, some have been from afar. When I think of Black History Month, I think it's an opportunity for, for all of us, um, African Americans, any culture, any group, to really sit back and reflect on the accomplishments, the, the achievements, uh, the struggle of the African Americans have gone through through the years. However, Dr. Gary says the focus can't all be about the struggles. But to look at how far we've come to celebrate those accomplishments. A mentor to hundreds of employees in addressing whether the inequities, inequalities, um, to try and correct them. And a role model to thousands of students. And to see me as a positive male African American role model is doing good things for kids. Dr. Gary knows all too well to expect the unexpected. A student wants himself aspirations of being an engineer, but found his passion was in teaching. All these years later, finding himself preparing our next generation by his leadership at District 5. They're going to go out into a very diverse society that will look unlike anything that they're seeing in schools. Dr. Gary says it's about finding commonalities in one another, looking at the content of a person in a time our country is seeing a lot of division. How can we learn from that? How can we learn to appreciate other people? Um, and, and really, as Dr. King talked about, looking at the content of their character and not making judgments based upon the color of their skin. Be an open book. Listen to them. Use your judgment, not the judgment of others. Very smart guy there. Yeah, I like but what he said there at the end. Crazy. He's going to be an engineer. He started substitute teaching and realized, all right, mm -hmm. teaching's my passion. Because his parents said he said, I didn't want anything to do with it. But... He said once he got in there and started teaching those kiddos, it's, he know. realized that's, that's what he was meant to do. And yeah. Look at him now, very I successful, know. and he's got a lot of people under him. But it goes mm -hmm. to show you, even though you don't want to step sometimes in that role model uh, spot, mm -hmm. you just become a role model to so many. It could happen like that. Yep. So he's love, doing a great job over in District 5. Love those stories. These have been really fun to tell.